As you could see from that colorful radar screen, the storm is moving in from the west, and that's where the weather is worst right now. That's also where News 13's Scott Daniels is live. Scott? Yeah, Dick, I'm several miles east of Gallup, and the snow cleared up a little bit, but it's been coming down fairly steadily for hours. Earlier this afternoon, the State Department of Transportation ordered the westbound lanes of I-40 from Gallup out to Arizona to be closed because there were so many weather-related wrecks out there. It has since reopened. The department has deployed 54 plows and salt trucks to crisscross this area, as well as several other parts around the state where driving conditions are difficult. That includes Trace Piedras and Chama areas, along with Silver City and their surrounding areas. But out here, we're told, is the worst right now. Down is an accident down on, I think, exit 9. And there's about three cars and one truck involved in it. So I'll wait till they clear up, clear up, and I'll start out. The road conditions look pretty good out there right now. Although the roads are reopened, the Department of Transportation wants drivers to slow down. The visibility is still bad. Dick, back to you. All right, Scott. Now, some New Mexico schools are already calling in closures and delays. You can see them on the bottom of the screen, or you will see them on the bottom of the screen. A complete and constantly updated list of closures is also available at krqe.com. Obviously, there is much more to come from this weather system. Stay with KRQE News 13 and krqe.com for the latest.